All right, we are live and being recorded, my friend. All right, good morning, everybody. Uh, my name is CJ, CJ June from here at Paladin. I'd like to welcome everyone to the Paladin Excellence in Coaching webinar series. Uh, again, my name is CJ June, and we're, uh, I've been with Paladin for about six years now, and I'm the manager of uh, the managed services department here at Paladin. Uh, we do uh, a lot of things, managed antivirus, uh, managed Office 365. A recent addition is what we're going to go over today, um, which is the uh, DataWise, which is managed automatic offsite backups. So let's go ahead and uh, get started here. We'll look at our first slide. I've got uh, Chad Klein. He's going to be my engineer. And uh, Brandon Hayes is also in the studio here, and he's going to be uh, uh, partnering with me, asking me some questions. So Brandon, anytime there's anything pertinent, or if you guys see any questions from uh, anyone here listening, no, and we can expand upon that. Let's get started here. Um, so data-wise, what is data-wise? Um, saving your data for a rainy day or a tornado day or a flood day. Um, DataWise is uh, our new managed service uh, that Paladin Point of Sale offers to automatically perform an off-site backup of your data. Um, I can go into a little bit of detail on how that works. Hopefully I'm not skipping ahead here uh, too far. But what happens, uh, kind of the nuts and bolts of it, um, is, well, let's look. I think the next slide covers that pretty well. Um, let me hit on this. So saving your data for a rainy day, tornado day, um, auto backup, data-wise, um, backups occur on the server computer, which needs to be left on. Uh, happens seven days a week after your store is closed. A little more detail on that. Um, at, uh, I believe it's midnight every night, we install, we install the uh, data-wise program to automatically run on the server computer, the Paladin server computer. And we do that because that is the computer that's left on all the time. Uh, and the computer does a, a couple of uh, maintenance programs every evening. And uh, then the DataWise program will kick in and do an automatic backup at about midnight, midnight 03. And then it takes that backup that's created and sends it over here to our servers uh, where it's stored securely and safely on our servers. Um, another thing that's really important is we actually manage um, the backup. So in other words, we check and verify that it is a viable good backup that can be used. Uh, we've had a lot of customers um, over the years that were doing the manual backups, and, and it's a good practice to continue to do the manual backups, especially several times throughout the day. But they were doing those, and they didn't know that the disk that they had used or the thumb drive was either full or corrupted, or for whatever reason, they weren't actually making a full backup. Uh, the backup wasn't the right size. Uh, and there's several things. So. Um, Having us manage that and being able to check to make sure that it is a good, viable backup, that's worth the weight of this. So it's a managed automatic backup as well. So it's a good, a good thing. And quick disaster recovery. So in the event that you need to retrieve your data from us, uh, natural disasters can occur, earthquake, fire, flood, tornado. Um, DataWise performs rapid rescue and sends your backup data on a new hard drive. We get it to you within 24 hours. Um, we had several stores that uh, were lost due to Hurricane Katrina, uh, lots of flood damage, and of course everybody keeps the, uh, the, the computer towers just sitting on the floor. It's amazing what a foot of water will do to a computer, uh, and those stores were down. <clears throat> if they, uh, if they weren't making automatic backups and taking them off-site, uh, those stores were, were done. Uh, so if we would have had DataWise uh, up and running at that time, which unfortunately we didn't, uh, it proved just to be a little more challenging to get a live, secure SQL database and be able to bring it over and store it securely here so that it could be reinstalled. Um, we have that now, but if we would have had that, uh, we could have saved uh, a lot of stores a lot of headache. So, but we can get that to you um, on a, uh, a hard drive and get that sent out and overnighted to you within 24 hours. Uh, or if uh, you had lost all your computers and need actually to have a whole computer, we can go ahead and uh, download your uh, data right onto uh, the Paladin computer. So the program will be up and running and ready to go with your data as of that night at midnight. And we'll get that to you within 24 hours to get you up and running and making money. Uh, as soon as possible because it's possible that the uh, natural disaster may not have just been local in your store. It may have been in your area. Uh, if your area was hit with a flood or a fire or 
uh, hurricane, some sort of natural disaster, uh, your store being up and open and able to make money is maybe going to be the life support to your community. Uh, so we need to get you up and running so you can start making those sales and helping the community through whatever natural disaster they have. Very important. So Now, <clears throat> they say that um, data loss, here's a couple of statistics, the uh, hardware failure, uh, can cause you to uh, have your store go down. A human error is a big problem. Again, everybody's doing a manual backup of those, and they're either doing it incorrectly, they forget, um, they can't check to see if it's a viable or usable backup. Uh, software corruption, theft, um, viruses, hardware destruction, the hardware died. They say $8,000 is the average cost for an hour of downtime for a small company. Now an hour, $8,000 an hour, think about that for a minute, that's a lot of money and I've actually had other stores say, no, 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 it wouldn't cost us, you know, $8,000. Well, take a minute and let's just figure out what that's going to be. What is your store's average hourly income? And I always tell people to go ahead and do the average hourly income uh, at their peak of business. Um, what, what do you make an hour at your store? Do you make $1,000 an hour on a good day, peak business? Do you make $8,000 a day or $8,000 an hour? Maybe it's a smaller store. Maybe you only do $500 or $250 in an hour. But that's $250 um, that you're going to lose if your store is down. And let's say your store is down for 8 or 10 hours. Uh, that starts adding up quickly. And let's not forget the store is down. So that's the people that are in the store right now. That's when they leave. They remember that your store was down. That could affect business for, for a while to come. So being able to get you back up and running as quick as possible, uh, having your data secure so we can get that back to you as soon as possible is a, is a lifesaver. Uh, auto save. Um, we keep your data private and secure on our Paladin servers. Like I said, it's automatic. It's done automatically. So we go ahead, uh, it triggers the backup and then automatically sends it here to us and then saves it uh, on the backups we have or on the servers we have here rather at Paladin. Um, and again, we verify that to make sure it's a good, usable, um, viable backup. Uh, instant setup, that's true. Um, we can go ahead and uh, once you have uh, got the DataWise program, uh, you can either buy that um, online directly yourself from our web store, uh, Paladin Web Store, um, and we can uh, we can get that. I think we have uh, a link to that uh, at the end of the presentation here. So if you wanted to go ahead and purchase that, you can purchase it directly from the web store. Uh, or you can go ahead and talk to anybody that's here at Paladin and they can go ahead and help you in getting that purchased. And once it is uh, purchased, it's very easy for us to set up. Uh, when you purchase DataWise online at the Paladin store, um, then we call you and we get a connection to the server computer and then we start the uh, automated backup process. Again, we do go ahead and install this on the Paladin server. Uh, the reason for that is because it's the computer that's normally going to be left on all the time so it can take advantage and run that backup. Uh, we monitor it here uh, to make sure everything is good, make sure it's a, a viable, usable backup, and it's automatic. So there's not anything more you would need to do after you purchase it. We'll get a hold of you and get a connection to that server computer and we'll go ahead and get everything set up. Uh, and then if there's ever a challenge, you know, say, <clears throat> excuse me, Say, for instance, you uh, maybe had a different manager with it that was closing up, or they closed the server computer so it didn't make a backup. Well, we would know that right away. We'd be able to get a hold of you, um, grab a backup maybe from earlier that morning, uh, let you know that a backup wasn't made that night so we can go ahead and get a current backup over here uh, to, in case of any kind of a catastrophe. We want to make sure that we have the very latest uh, backup information for you. But it's all automated and it's, it's uh, instant, not to worry. <clears throat> Okay, story time. Have uh, I don't know if there's any questions or anything that has uh, come down from anyone there. I got anything? a question for you, CJ. Sure, go ahead. Yeah, this this is Brandon here. I uh, do you have any examples um, that you can provide us uh, regarding any customer that may have experienced any sort of natural disaster and what had happened if he or she was signed up with DataWise? Yeah, yeah, that's that's a um, good question. Um, there's been a couple of stores. Uh, about three years ago, there was a, a hardware store, and it was actually his, I think his grandfather had started the hardware store, um, and the location was an old train depot. 
um, and it was kind of a historic building. And his father had picked it up, and then the grandson, um, he had picked it up and then started with Paladin and was being very successful. Excuse me, was being very successful, um, but uh, he came to work um, one morning and he said there was a three alarm fire. Uh, he had uh, fire trucks from three different counties that were there trying to help put out the blaze. Come to find out, old train depots are made of wood, and old wood and it burns quickly and really fast. So he was amazed, did a control burn, it was a total loss. He did have insurance, uh, which was great, and the insurance adjuster said, yes, I can definitely see that you had a fire and uh, it looks like you might have had a business or something here uh, in, at one time. Now he was making backups, um, like we had instructed him to, and he was taking those backups and putting them on a DVD, and he was putting them in his desk drawer right next to his computer, and his desk drawer was made out of wood. It wasn't a fireproof safe or anything, so his desk burnt to the ground along with all of his backups. The bad part about that is the insurance company said, great, you say that you have a million dollars worth of, in, worth of uh, inventory in your store at the time of the fire. I have no problem going ahead and paying you for that. We just need to prove that you had a million dollars worth of inventory. He had nothing. Um, he could prove he had a store, um, but uh, couldn't prove inventory. He had some pictures of inventory that they were going to go off of, and they said, well, you know, the inventory in these pictures may be a few thousand dollars. Um, so he had, he had nothing. Um, so he wasn't able to provide anything to the insurance company, so they were going to give him a few thousand dollars and then pay for the structure. We luckily um, had been working on his database about six months previous uh, and actually had an old copy of his database from six months ago that proved that he had X amount of dollars in inventory. It wasn't the full million dollars, um, but it was enough to where he was able to get a a, a fairly good payout um, from the insurance company. So if he would have had the data wise backed up on our servers here, we would have been able to have gotten him that information uh, within 24 hours, probably put on a new computer uh, so he could pull up that information, get it to his insurance adjuster uh, right away, and they would have been able to cut him a check uh, that would have been a reasonable dollar amount. Um, so that would have saved him. And there was a pharmacy um, that had a, a similar situation. It wasn't a fire. The pharmacist came in and uh, he had three computers there at the pharmacy and all three of his computers had been stolen. Apparently they didn't take any drugs or medication or anything, but they stole all three computers. So all of his data was gone. Now he was not doing backups of any kind at all. Um, so <laughs> you have no customer records, you have no prescriptions on file, you have no credit card transactions. So he was basically starting his store all over again from day one with no customers, uh, with no inventory logged into his system. He was starting over. Uh, it was more than he could handle and he ended up closing the store just because it, there was nothing. I mean, it was uh, catastrophic. So if he would have had the DataWise program uh, set up here with us, within 24 hours we could have got him a new computer or three new computers uh, with the data backed up on it, and it would have been just like it was from the night before it met. Those are a couple of classic examples of how the, uh, the DataWise program is going to definitely save your store and keep you up and going, and not only help yourself, but you might be the lifeline uh, in, your, in your community as well. So let's, uh, getting started with DataWise, uh, it's free until November 1st of this year. We've kind of have an early adopters um, incentive. So it's $59 a month after November 1st. Now that's less than $2 a day. So if you're paying somebody to uh, make the backups manually and you're paying them $10 an hour, that's about $2.50 for the 15 minutes that it takes. We're, we're only charging you $2 a day and the main thing is is we monitor that. We can make sure that it is a good viable backup and that it did happen. Um, sometimes the employee that you have that's in charge of this uh, may be somebody that uh, might be have other duties or other things that they're doing that uh, might be not too high on their priority list, and it is your entire store. Um, it is pretty important to uh, just kind of make sure, and of course, if we remember that first slide, uh, some of these were 
caused by human error. Uh, it was forgotten. It wasn't checked. So if you would like to, go ahead and sign up, contact the managed services department here, uh, myself or Brandon, uh, or purchase the DataWise online at the Paladin store. We'd love to get you set up and uh, help you take care of this. It's very quick. It's very easy. It's definitely one of the managed services that uh, I think is probably the most important. Um, Antivirus is very important as well, but these two kind of go hand in hand. Uh, we're here for you. We want to keep you safe. We're kind of passionate about these things because uh, I, I think it's a real good value and it actually helps the customers uh, have a hard time getting behind something that might be fluff or might be something that's uh, not a good value. But I really believe in Palette and I believe in what we're doing and I believe that uh, the DataWise um, is an excellent step and I think we should make it mandatory, but that's not my call. Um, definitely need to get this. Uh, make sure that you've got good backups. And this is important. Um, there are other um, backups that are available that are out there. The problem with the other backups is this, what you're doing is you're backing up your store, your livelihood uh, from the past eight or ten years or however long you've been in business. But this is not just pictures of the family vacation that you're trying to back up. Some of the other backups out there can handle those just fine and they'll be able to retrieve those and, and get you know pictures of uh, your son's ninth birthday. And those are great to have. This is a live, secure SQL database. This is much more advanced, much more difficult to make a copy of, and much more difficult to get to play with Paladin and get put back in. Our engineers here have that mastered and we've got that down, so um, it is something that's a little more involved uh, than just going ahead and backing up uh, files of family vacations and things. And this is just a step. Um, one of the things we have right now is this is only happening right now um, just every evening at midnight. So you're getting the backup from that day up until midnight. Now eventually they are working on um, bringing in more backups. So eventually it's going to be you know several times the next day. Uh, so you'll have backups eventually several times a day. Uh, possibly backups uh, once every hour that are going to happen and then there's going to be that information is going to be sent over here to us uh, and eventually um, it's supposed to be up to where it's you know once an hour or once every 15 minutes or something um, I don't know if there's going to be any advanced charges uh, on that but I know this is the first step and it's only going to get stronger uh, and go forward we want to keep you safe and uh, data wise is uh, the best way to go Okay, guys, is there uh, any questions or anything that we have for the uh, for the the data wise or anything I can expand upon? No, no questions at this time. I think we're uh, covered pretty thoroughly. Brandon, do you agree? I agree. Yeah, I think we're good. Perfect. Okay. Well, if that uh, if that is it, again, if you have any questions uh, to any of the listening audience, you guys can go ahead and get a hold of us here at Paladin. Our number is one eight hundred seven two five two three four six and the managed services department is seven zero zero two uh, you can call us anytime again that number is one eight hundred seven two five two three four six that'll get you here to us at Paladin and also on the uh, Paladin web store you can go ahead and order that yourself uh, and that'll get it over to us and then we'll go ahead and give you a call um, I uh, would like to go ahead and just remind you that uh, we do webinars um, every week. Go ahead and tune in. I don't know what the next one is going to be at this time, but um, go ahead and tune in. Uh, these are helpful and this is being recorded so you can always go ahead and tune in uh, and review this uh, later on. Really appreciate the help. Uh, Chad Klein was the engineer. Brandon Hayes, co-presenter. Appreciate it, uh, guys. Nice work, sirs. Likewise. Have a good week, everyone.